So here's what you need to know about Chelsea, Quebec, where I live, where I work. Here's 10 things that'll kind of give you an idea about what this community is all about. So first of all, it's a small community and it's only, well, it's less than 15 minutes from Ottawa Gatineau going north. About 8,000 residents in total in the whole community, so not a, a huge population. Generally speaking, um, it's about a 50-50 language split between French and English. It's very welcoming that way. 121 uh, square kilometer community, and you know what? It's squeezed between the Gatineau Park and the Gatineau River, and it's really connected to nature. So here are the 10 things that make Chelsea, Chelsea. Prior to 2016, the typical home in Chelsea was a single family home on an acre lot, more rural feeling. But now there are three higher density communities closer to the city with every kind of home there is. Single family homes, semi-detached, town homes, condos. There's a house for everybody in Chelsea. So this is Chelsea Creek. This is the second higher density development in Chelsea. It's just on the other side of the Highway 5. I love the aesthetic here, lots of stone and big beams, a little bit of a Tromla feel to it. And this uh, development is very close to the soccer fields and the community school and Chelsea Elementary School and the baseball field. So the third neighborhood is Corte Meredith. And I love this location because it's right adjacent to the soccer fields and the community center. You can walk to the baseball diamond and the skating rink. There's even a little walking path to get to the grocery store. This one's more contemporary, a little bit more modern, very, very nice. So I've always said one of the big draws for families, particularly in Chelsea, is the schools. The schools are fantastic. There's both an English and a French elementary school. The English elementary school offers a very high concentration of French. The French elementary school is amazing and it has its even, even has its own sugar shack in the back. So if you like maple syrup, that's a great way to go. There's uh, a nursery school that's a forest school. The kids are outside all day long. It's a great program. It's being replicated in other parts of the country. The schools here in Chelsea are great. So do you like food? Well, in Chelsea, you're in luck. We have everything. High-end fine dining. Three incredible pizza places. Shawarma shops. Uh, we've got uh, more coffee shops than you can shake a stick at. Handmade ice cream, Indian food, a lot of locally sourced uh, ingredients, farmer's markets, it's food paradise here. And the Gatineau Park, which is kind of the heart and soul of the Chelsea community. It's a cyclist, a hikers, and a cross-country skiers paradise. It's famous, it's incredible, and it's not just the different parking lots where you can access it. All the residents have lots of private trails all throughout the community that can get you into the Gatineau Park. So we've talked about cross-country skiing and trails and everything in the Gatineau Park. And yet, five minutes from the village, there's an alpine ski area, Camp Fortune, seven alpine lifts, 24 trails. It's got everything. There's challenging terrain. It's a great place to learn how to ski, a huge ski school. And then in the summer, there's zip lines, there's um, alpine slides. It's a really great four season resort. Wait till you experience the Chelsea Community Trail. So they took an old railway bed that runs along the Gatineau River, full length of the community, and now it's a four season playground. It's one of the nicest bike paths, one of the nicest places to walk a dog. And boy, in the winter, they groom it for cross country skiing. It's amazing all year round. So if you're a water lover, Chelsea is for you. Of course, there's a Gatineau River, miles and miles of navigable waterway. The water tests drinkable, believe it or not, most of the time. There are lakes in the Gatineau Park with public beaches like uh, Lac Philippe and Meech Lake. And on the Gatineau River, uh, there's a sailing club and there's a paddling club. It's beautiful. Okay, so you've had your hike and your bike and your ski. Now what? Well, go to North America's largest spa, Spa Nordique, right in Chelsea. The place is incredible. If you're a thrill seeker, Chelsea has something for you too. North America's highest bungee jump. Now, I'm not gonna do it, but you definitely should. I'm John McIntyre with Century 21. Cheers.